closer to you And it's getting dark in this room Tell me what you wanna do What's going on, Knights? I'm Jared Thomas. And I'm Skylar Carbon. Welcome, Welcome to the Royal Report News. First, let's kick it over to Bailey for another edition of Havasu Happenings. Good morning, Knights, and welcome to another edition of Havasu Happenings. Stick around to see what's new. If you love to dance, cheer, tumble, and stun, listen up. Cheer tryouts begin Monday, May 6th through Thursday, May 9th. Tryouts are located in the aerobics room from 3 to 4.30. Ms. Razik is looking for a new team and hidden talents from students of LHHS. The Spring Choir Concert is May 7th at 7 in the pack. Admission is free, so come down and support the choir. With prom right around the corner, that means Spirit Week. So listen up so you know how to dress up. Tuesday, May 7th is Red Carpet Day. Wednesday, May 8th is Celebrity Lookalike Day. Thursday, May 9th is Glam vs. Grunge Day. And Friday, May 10th, is Purple and Gold Day. Well, that's all I have for you today, Knights. I'm Bailey, and remember to just keep swimming. Now back to you guys at the studio. Thanks, Bailey. Hey, Skylar, have you gotten to see what's coming out on Netflix? No, but I did go see Endgame. Oh. Well, if you haven't been able to see what's coming out, let's go see what's coming, leaving, and trending on Netflix. Hey, everyone. I'm Rhiannon Westlake, and here's what's coming, leaving, and trending on Netflix right now. First, here's what's leaving. The Bridge to Terabithia, The Boss Baby, South Paw, Eight Mile, High School Musical 3, The Notebook, The Lovely Bones, and Sixteen Candles. Now for what's coming. Knock Down the House, Extremely Wicked, Shockingly Evil and Vile, Dead to Me Season 1, Lucifer Season 4, Easy Season 3, The Society Season 1, She's Gotta Have It Season 2, and Wine Country. And for the top 10 trending movies on Netflix, about Time, The Graduate, Jaws, The Silence of the Lambs, Avengers Infinity War, Roma, The Indiana Jones Trilogy, The Notebook, High Flying Bird, and The 40-Year-Old Virgin. So be sure to say goodbye to the ones that are leaving and check out the ones that are coming. Wow, I might have to go watch some of those. Hey Jared, do you know what special day is coming up? Of course, it's Cinco de Mayo! But if you don't know what Cinco de Mayo is, here's a short video to explain it. Cinco de Mayo, or the 5th of May, is not Mexico's Independence Day. I repeat, it is not Mexico's Independence Day. One more time, May 5th is not Mexico's Independence Day. Now that we have that out of the way, Cinco de Mayo is actually the date in 1862 when an underdog group of outnumbered loyal Mexican soldiers defeated the French army at the Battle of Puebla during the Franco-Mexican War. While the occasion is rarely celebrated in Mexico, the United States uses the date as a celebration of Mexican culture and heritage. With celebrations ranging from parades, music, and traditional foods like tacos, it's a great way to show appreciation towards Hispanic heritage. Feliz Cinco de Mayo! Hey Jared, have you bought your yearbook yet? Of course I have, but for those who haven't, here's your last chance to buy yours. <laughs> That's all we have for you today, Knights. I'm Skylar. And I'm Jared. And I hope to catch you on game day.